Our ecosystem starts with a garden at the epicenter. First, we add bees. Not only do we get honey and wax, but they also offer us pollination services, which increases our yield. We cater to both native and honeybee populations. Next, we keep ducks on the farm, not just for eggs, but for down feathers, and they fertilize as they forage. But in the gardens, they actually get rid of our roly polies, snails, and slugs, and other insects that affect our wet climate. Geese act as watchdogs to those ducks. They also offer us down feathers and eggs. They fertilize. They help clean up the gardens at the end of the seasons, but they also help to maintain our pastures. The livestock guardian dogs we keep help to keep the entire flock safe. We get wool from our sheep that we can use for spinning into yarn, but also sloppy seconds can be used as mulch in the garden spaces. Also, any bedding can be composted and added to the gardens. They also graze our grasses and go through our forage areas. This is great because when they graze, they interrupt the parasite life cycle that infects horses and the horses do the same for the sheep. We also use our horses for pulling, riding, and composting manure. When the flock goes through last during pasture rotation, they also break apart manure piles, ingesting parasites as they go. Now we also keep guineas on the farm because they're great at foraging specifically for ticks. Eradicating those ticks is gonna keep all of these animals healthy. I also keep a couple of barn cats. They help to keep the gardens clear of rodents, but also in removing those rodents, they're removing the ticks that those rodents carry, which keeps everybody healthy, safe, and happy, and ultimately helps the garden.